uh, they're used to paying a thousand dollars a square inch for land down there. They come up to look at this land at a uh, hundred dollars an acre, and they tremendous bargain, and they will double that just because they want it. They'll go triple mm -hmm. because they don't really know what they're doing. Yeah. And, uh, and it, it's it's too bad that this land may have to go that way. The ecology of Tug Hill is very delicate. It is. You can't tell this to a lot of people unless you take them up there and show them. Just so happens that the South Branch and the Leapad Creeks come are branched right there on the railroad, just a mile from where my camp is. And when you look at the South Branch, which drains right straight down into Lake Ontario, and when you look at its beginning and see what's going on with the ecology, and the fact that there's certain things we're getting trees that are starting to die. Why? Because we've got acid rain or anything you want to call it, but where there's problems. 30 years on Tug Hill, and you can ask Elvin Rowell, who's a professional on Tug Hill, mm -hmm. and he'll tell you 30 years you have a tree barely ready for market. Mm -hmm. If you want to go out and plant trees, that's fine, but you want to have somebody there gardening because dearly.